Hey guys, Big Big Flow here. How have you been? Uh, I came back from Canada not too long ago, and uh, you know, when you travel, you bring back gifts from your family, souvenirs, and things like that, right? The thing is, Canada is you want to bring back something that has to do with maple syrup, and something that I love that is based uh, maple syrup based. It's maple spread, or some call it maple butter. It looks like this. If you're from Canada, you would know that this is quite pricey. And uh, I thought to myself, how hard can it be to make your own? So yeah, that's right. Today, I'm becoming a cooking channel. Let's go. Before we start that video, I need to say that this video is not sponsored by Nike, McDonald's, Amazon, or not even by Samsung. This video is not sponsored. Please sponsor me anyone five bucks that will do here are the things that you will need one pot two pots one half spoon a thermometer that you will later use to control the temperature of your maple syrup as you boil it yes we're gonna boil it a bowl that we will later fill with ice so we can cool down what we do a measuring cup and an empty container that you will need to have ready uh, to be filled at the end. You will also need a touch of vegetal oil, apparently it's to avoid the maple syrup to boil over. Your notes, so you don't forget anything. You will obviously need maple syrup, your pens on, that's more of a reminder for me as I'm on camera, and some good copyright free music. Just so we're clear, I've never done it before, I'm attempting it, that might be a total mess, but let's try it anyway. Step one. Wash your hands. Twice. Add the oil. Add the thermometer. And add your maple syrup. Add all of it. Like, seriously, all of it. Bring the temperature up to 112 degrees. Pour in the ice bath and wait until it reaches body temperature like wait really wait it's just wait start stirring even though at this point i screwed up and i didn't realize it okay full disclosure i think it wasn't working because my thermometer started to acting up so I had to reboil it to pour it again in the ice bath and we'll try again and see if I will end up with something that would be nice start again the ice bath and now you can start stirring and trust me it should feel pretty hard if it feels too easy, you're also doing it wrong. All right, we're getting there. Now that's a nice color. But don't wait too long before pouring it, otherwise it will harden up just like it happened to me and it will be a real struggle to get it in. Do you know how there are some stuff in life that you love and you might sometimes wonder mm, I don't know how much I love that, like what, what could I be ready to do to get that thing? I love maple butter, but I know I will never <laughs> going to be doing that ever again. Long story short, here are the few things that might go wrong <laughs> when you're trying to make maple butter. One. The thermometer you just bought might not be working well and then we screw up all of your measurements. Two, because you didn't realize that soon enough, you might have to boil it again. Three, the ice bath you had previously made is now half melted and is almost useless, so good luck cooling it down. Four, you might start to get a headache at some point, but you can't stop because you started to stir and if you stop, it will harden up. Five, you might be stirring for something like, I don't know, 40 minutes and your hands start to hurt, you don't feel anything but the pain. See, those. 
and six, the best for the end. You're supposed to stir until it gets a nice color, kind of like that. And then when you stop stirring, you have like 30 seconds to pour it before it hardens up. However, when I thought, oh, that's a good color, I'm gonna start pouring it. It started to harden up while I was stirring and that stupid It's like, it's so hard now, it's, it's crumbling, it's crumbling apart. Tastes great though, but see, it's like, I, I, I don't know how you want to call that beside the fuck. Anyways, I hope somehow you enjoyed it. Feel free to subscribe, to share with whoever is gonna attempt to make some maple butter and uh, I will see you guys around. See ya!